My name is uh, Dr. Christopher Eckford, and I'm the principal at North Shore Middle School here in Galena Park ISD, Houston, Texas. You know, I had some great experiences along the way, but 2017, December, was a uh, year I came out of Sam Houston State with my doctor degree. I've had students to say in college, you know, uh, that came back after a semester or two in college, or maybe after a year or two that graduated, they come back and they say, the things that you said to us in the hallway or the locker room, you know, the way you carried yourself, you know, uh, you know, you were an influence to us, you were a role model to us. And I was like, but y'all never told me that. And they say, yeah, but we watched you though. You know, we watched you and the way you moved and how you talk with so much passion, we saw that, you know, and we would say in college in our dorm room, when we were thinking about doing something crazy, we would say, Coach Eckwood would say this, or Coach Eckwood would say that. You know, when I get those type of stories, you know, that makes it worthwhile. Obviously, you know, and I tell people that, you know, in education, nobody's gonna retire a millionaire, and at least not anyone that I know. But it's these, it's these stories that keep you here. You know, it's these, it's these stories that keep you going. You know, even on bad days, when you could tap into the memories of those students that you've touched. And you know, you're not gonna touch everyone, but you, you know, but definitely in trying, you just never know. It might not be evident at that moment, but you know, we're just watering, you know, we're just watering seeds right now. All right, so the one thing that I want to be remembered for is uh, just creating this, uh, a campus culture of love. Um, I believe, and it's on my marquee, that love conquers all and it covers all. And I believe that. Our campus uh, earned an A rating with uh, the state of Texas. Last year, when we earned the A rating with those students, we had over 85% uh, economically disadvantaged students and well over 1,377 students. And that's unprecedented. And uh, one of the things I'm also proud about is I'm the first African-American principal here on this campus. And that was, that was brought to my attention when we got the A. So it's a testament to the people that I work with. People say everything starts and ends with the principal, and that's true. But I, I can't take credit for that. You know, I stand on the shoulders of some very intelligent people, some caring and compassionate people, uh, some, you know, some people who will go to bat for our students in every sense of the word. And so, uh, you know, I'm their biggest cheerleader. I tell them, you know, I'll do everything but put a cheerleader uniform on. But uh, I'm very proud of the aid that we've earned, and uh, the kids know it as well. They'll tell you when you talk to them that I go to an A-rated campus. So I'm pretty proud about that. And so since uh, I'm here to accept this award, I'm, I'm accepting it on behalf of my, my, my colleagues, my staff, uh, my school community, my district, my family. Um, and if my mom was alive, I would be accepting it on her behalf as well because I'm nothing without, you know, uh, I'm, I'm not the man that I am if it wasn't for Rachel Hicks. Uh, and so as I sign off, I'll say that I'm Rachel Hicks' baby boy, saying it's been a plum pleasing pleasure as well as a privilege. Thank you guys so much.